Hello, hello, welcome to my channel. I'm Sim Lunacy and today we're continuing with the Legend of Pachi Challenge. I can't believe we're up to episode 50 already. I think today what we might do is we're waiting for Griselda to give birth to our second child. I'm going to try and hurry a few other things up that I have in mind. So let's head to the farm. Oh my gosh, we're here with Griselda. Looks like she's hopping up to look after Rose quite heavily pregnant I think she's in her third trimester not quite yet but I think it's also Rose's birthday quite soon just giving her a bit of a feed now we do have quite a bit to accomplish today um, I'm going to try to get Hugo into a relationship with Brenton who is the old mayor they were getting quite flirty at all of the gatherings um, and maybe even move out to the house that I had set aside for the mayor. Hopefully no one else has moved in. Um, and then we're just waiting for Griselda to give birth. So she's taking care of baby Rose and now she's going to take care of herself. It's quite early in the morning. Um, looks like Hugo is actually already up. And playing with our glitched out cow plant. Um, I might get him to come feed all the animals. So let's see. We don't need to clean the coop. We'll scatter feed. Uh, where's... Where's... We don't need to clean the coop, but we will scatter some feed. We'll also collect the eggs. Quite a few chickens. Let's see. We do need to feed uh, sunshine as well. So let's clean the shed. And we'll refill the food there. Let's check on Griselda. Okay, she's having a bite to eat. Now, I think I might get her to just get dressed quickly. Clean out the spoiled food from her inventory. Outfits, uh, change outfit to every day. While Patrick's sleeping. I might come get Griselda to, can we? I don't want to inferniate. Um, I do want to write a genre book, a children's book. And we might get Hugo to come clear all of this up. Let's see how close Patrick is to waking up. Okay, here we go. Secret of Patchy. Patchy the Scarecrow has a secret. Hidden within these pages are the clues that will lead you to a most amazing story. Good luck, Griselda. Okay, Hugo. Looks like he's finished up with sunshine. Time for Patrick to wake up. So Patrick, I don't think he has any needs aside from hunger, but we can lay that aside. Let's uh, give Sunshine a bit of a pet. We'll clean Sunshine and Shear. How's the garden looking? Looks like we have a few things to harvest as well. What's wrong with this cherry tree? Let's, har let's harvest all and tend the garden. Sunshine, you okay? Good, okay. Hugo, buddy old pal. I think we're going to get you to give uh, Brendan a call. 
Leave off, Griselda. He's only trying to clean up the dishes. Brenton. Let's invite to hang out at current lot. Hugo's a bit sleepy. So moving Hugo out is going to have two advantages. We're going to get another room for the second child. Um, also, no witnesses. <laughs> hey, friendly. Let's uh, give him a gift. What do we have to give? Not much. Um, want some earbuds? Let's uh, flirt a bit. We'll see how he reacts. <laughs> Looks like he liked it. Looks like he liked that too. Uh, you know, Hugo, I just happen to have this potion. Hmm. This will help me greatly. Oh, he's a bit mad about that. Like, you don't think that I can do this on my own? Uh, Griselda. <gasps> no! That's not what I meant. See, he doesn't like Griselda. Right, resume. Hugo, oh my gosh, I that is so... Share outdoorsy tips. Uh, let's ask a risque question. Ask about interests. Ask if single. Compliment appearance. Patrick's getting himself some food. Oh my gosh, he's married. Well, so much for that. Let's try something else. Can we move? How do we move? Home. No. How do we move? Split from household and move. Patrick. Change, bottle feed, cuddle. Okay, Hugo's the new household and he's taking his million dollars. And he's out of here. Here we go. Hugo has a new home. So he has moved into the house that I set aside for the mayor. Um, looks like he needs the bathroom. And food. And I guess we should set a bed for him. I don't even know what's in this house. Uh, looks like the bedrooms are upstairs. What's the best looking room? This one. There we go. 
Now, is there anyone that he is particularly close to besides Brenton who's actually married? Not really. So I think we're going to leave him to his own devices and head back to Patrick. Where on earth are we? Patrick, go home! What on earth was he doing all the way out here? Oh, I worked out how to mess with neighbourhood stories. Apparently it's on the letterbox. Um, check neighbourhood... Check neighbourhood stories. There we go. The BFF household moved out. That's it? Yes, me. Yes, me. Well, that's no fun. Why is the mayor still here? Hey! Excuse me. Send home. Is Griselda still writing? Griselda, you need to finish this book. And Patrick, is he on his way in? Yes. Oh gosh, a bird flew the house. Level two parenting. Right, we need to bottle feet. Cuddle. Kuat. Now, how did you get on with this garden? I feel like you did not tend the garden. It does look like you've harvested everything, though. So let's come check the bees. Oh, Rose, honey, why are you still so grumpy? You need a nappy change now. Can we do it by clicking on the... No. There we go. Much better. So come on out here, change into your beekeeper suit. And let's collect the honey. There's no more wax. They don't need a mite treatment. Oh, Hugo's still got the eggs. Oh, well. Let's uh, remove and bond with the bees. And I think we'll head to town and sell our goods. I'm almost too scared to check if everyone's the same. Nope. They're not. It's a new bartender. And a new grocer. Alright, let's let's see if we can buy some grocery items. We don't have our million dollar fallback anymore, so we kind of need... I'd like a little bit more money. I'm pretty sure we've got all of these. I don't remember if we had a dragon fruit. I'm just going to buy one. Maybe a huckleberry. I don't know, maybe a pomegranate. Okay, I think that's pretty good. Um, I would like to get some more veggies. Let's sell our items. I forgot we had this much stuff. 
Whew, okay, 200 clicks. We got 3,000 simoleons. And I was careful not to sell the pomegranate, dragon fruit, and huckleberry. So I think I'm going to get some more crops. That's not Agnes's normal voice. Okay. Seeds. I think I'm going to get... I like having pumpkins. How many plots do I have? Maybe I'll just get all pumpkins. Mosquito trap seeds? Maybe a random flowers? Speaking of flowers, does she have a tulip? I think I accidentally planted it. Okay. Thank you very much. We're going to head home now. Oh, looks like the festival of snow has started. Let's in this garden. Oh, hello. Who are you? Brady Pollard. Uh, go away. So I'm just going to put those things from our inventory in there. So we've got the dragon fruit, the pomegranate, and the huckleberry. Flintwick Fair has started. Oh, looks like it's oversized crop and pies. Well, Patrick doesn't actually know how to cook. And we don't have any crops. Oh, let's open this. What did we get? Oh, a tulip. Wait, no we didn't. A chrysanthemum and a daisy. We've, we have, we have those. Actually, where do we see the collections. Here. I was just wondering, like, we've got 26 of the 32 gardening plants. What is that? Wow, wow. There is quite a few that we don't have. I think some of them are alien ones though. So what's one of the basic ones we're missing? That looks like it might be... Oh, I don't even know. Plantain. That's probably a snapdragon. What would that be? A lemon, probably. Yeah. I bet it's a lemon, and I know where to get one. Oh, hey! Who are you? Just white hen. Mm -hmm. You have to name them all. Right, Griselda, how did you go writing that book? Did you finish? Not quite. Um, Patrick, be a dear and come clean this up. Did you, oh my gosh, did you just sit on a chicken? Did she just sit on the chicken? So how long until she finishes her book? I don't know. Um... I think actually what I might do is leave the part here. We are just waiting for Griselda to give birth, which she is in her third trimester.
but I don't think we're going to have time to follow her to the hospital if it happens any time soon. So we might leave that till next time. We'll also plant the crops next time. Well, a bit of a shame that Hugo had to move out by himself, but he's on a brand spanking new farm, quite a fancy one, I must say, and he's venturing out on his own to lead his own path. Um, we're still waiting for Griselda to give birth and finish the book and for Rose to grow up. Also for Patrick to plant those crops. So I guess until next time, please leave your feedback, comments and suggestions down below. Hit that like button. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye.